Schools and colleges in Chennai, Thiruvallur, Chengalpattu and Kanchipuram districts of Tamil Nadu have been ordered to stay closed today amid a heavy rainfall alert. Chennai and its suburbs, including those falling under nearby Thiruvallur district, have been experiencing intermittent rain since last night. In fact, Chief Minister M.K. Stalin has urged IT firms to allow the employees of these districts to work from home today until the 18th. Mr. Stalin has also directed the National Disaster Response Force and the Tamil Nadu Disaster Response Force to be deployed in advance in the areas that are prone to be affected. My colleague Sam Daniel is tracking the latest for us on Ground Zero. Listen in. Right, Sam, the IMD has predicted heavy to extremely heavy rainfall across Tamil Nadu, Puducherry and Karaikal regions over the next three days. Well, it's an orange alert for tomorrow, very heavy rainfall and uh, for today and for tomorrow it's going to be a red alert, extremely heavy rainfall in Chennai and the adjoining district and several parts of Tamil Nadu. We come to you from the Tansi Nagar, a very chronic hotspot known for inundation and authorities have already deployed boats here to make sure if the water levels go up, if there is heavy inundation, they will be able to rescue people quickly. Last year in December, we witnessed neck deep waters in this area. The roads are inundation free. If you can see on my left side, the traffic is normal, but authorities are not taking any chances this time. And in fact, the residential area this side is in a very low lying area. And every time there is heavy rainfall, there will be inundation, waters entering homes. But this time, so far, that kind of situation has not happened because there is enough gap after every spell of uh, downpour. In terms of the total rainfall received so far, till 5.30 this morning, the Met Office says 59 millimeters rain. That's very little less than heavy rainfall, but with so much of downpour since morning, this would have crossed six centimeters. We await a formal announcement. And here you have a medical camp underway to make sure people living in low-lying areas do not get into a contract with an infection and this kind of a medical camp is also held in several pockets. In terms of preparation, authorities say they have deployed around 300 boats in low-lying pockets just to be sure in case of any major flooding they will be able to evacuate people. They have also put in place systems like machinery to desilt water bodies in case if it is required. Also. 300 tractors with pumps with them so that they'll be able to deploy them if there is a need for that kind of an evacuation. The big worry is authorities say Chennai and pockets of Tamil Nadu could receive up to 40 centimeters rain today and tomorrow and on a single day the rainfall could touch 20 centimeters. Whether they'll be able to handle that kind of a heavy downpour that's the big worry but so far things are okay no major inundation area of these low light pockets. It's a rain holiday for schools and colleges in Chennai and adjoining districts. IT companies have been advised to switch to work from home more. It's beginning to pour very heavily and Chief Minister MK Stalin has advised people to factor in this kind of an extremely heavy rainfall possibility and to make arrangements in terms of taking care of the elderly, expectant mothers and those who are sick at home. Metro rail service has more frequency today so that those who are stranded will be able to move faster. No major impact on public transport, but the big worry, will the city be able to handle if the rainfall crosses 20 centimeters? Last year, in this area, we waded through neck deep waters and as the rainfall begins to increase, that's the big worry. The Met Office says, the low pressure over the Bay of Bengal will now intensify into a depression and then move towards north, northern parts of Tamil Nadu and Puducherry and head towards the southern part of Andhra Pradesh as well. So Tamil Nadu and Puducherry bracing for extremely heavy rainfall, so far things under control. The big worry, will the city and the state be able to handle the extreme, extremely heavy rainfall expected? Authorities say they are fully prepared.